Dan Hatcher isn't your average 16 year old. It feels like a little unique to be born on the 29th. And I usually try to tell them if they don't, you know, people that don't know. This year, Hatcher gets to celebrate his 64th birthday on the actual day. Otherwise, he just picks. Whatever's convenient. 28th, the first, you know, anytime like that. What was it like growing up with this special birthday? We were uh, raised, you know, kind of without a lot of things, you know, so just having the birthday was a good thing for us coming up, but uh, a little cake or something. Uh, but no, it, it, it hasn't been any different for being the 29th, you know, I mean, mm -hmm. as far as what the celebration is. What are people's reactions to, to have, you know, when they find out that you were born on the 29th? Well, you have a lot of questions. People ask you, when do you celebrate your birthday and how old are you and all this? But, uh, I, I, now I'm 16, finally. 16. The age most people get behind the wheel for the first time, but Hatcher is an old pro at driving now. He's been at it for almost 50 years. My first car I ever, I ever owned was like a 55 Pontiac, I guess. And uh, it didn't run. <laughs> the first car I ran was like a 40 Ford pickup. I bought it at the beach when someone I was working. This Vietnam vet continues to work with cars at an auto parts shop in Mullins, a pastime he enjoys almost as much as he likes talking about his birthday. Do you think that your birthday is any at all special? It is to me, yeah. <laughs> uh -huh. Why? I, I, well, I, I, the more you have, the, you're still living as long as you're having birthdays. In Mullins, Amy Vetrano, News 13.